Hello everyone and welcome back. We have some huge news dropping today um, for NCAA football. It's going to be a full feature reveal, full game reveal. Um, we did hear some news recently about Road to Glory where high school, um, the high school years are not going to be included in that Road to Glory, which a lot of people are mad about. Some people don't care about. It just is what it is. EA is going to make decisions. They're going to remove features. That's just what happens. That's just what happens. I think one of the biggest things that people are looking forward to and trying to figure out is how to play the game and how to play the game early. So today, I am going to show you all the best way to play EA College Football 25 early. Um, there's a couple of different ways that you can do it, and I'm going to show you. Uh, the two methods that I really know about that I'm going to look towards doing um, and then you can decide which one's best uh, one is a more cost-effective way of doing it and then the other is like a guaranteed like uh, no questions asked this is a, a, a way to do it so the first way we're going to look at is going to involve uh, EA play technically you can use this for both to get a 10% discount on the game which is really big um, you can get one month of EA Play on Xbox or on on PlayStation for I think it's like $5.99 a month or like $34 for the whole year. But if you just want to pay and get the 10% discount, you're essentially saving the money that you would pay by using it, but you get early access. Anyways, let's take a look. Let's dive in. So if you go to the pre-order now section, and you see like okay ea play plus college football 25 what you can see is that before the game releases on july 16th to july 19th you get a 10 hour early access trial that starts on july 16th so what you can essentially do is come in and pay 5.99 for EA Play in the month of July. You can do it July 1st. You don't have to do it now. You don't have to do it later. And if you're pre-ordering the game, it doesn't really matter when you pre-order. You're not gonna like lose access to your pre-order. This is definitely a way to do this. All that being said, what you can do to most easily access EA College Football 25 is to get one month of EA Play here. Um, and once you have EA Play, you've paid for your one month, you can go in and purchase the game, pre-order it on whatever uh, whatever console you have. What I would suggest doing is if you want the cheapest experience, but the early access, you can do EA Play for a month, then purchase the standard edition. And if you purchase the standard edition, you're getting access to the full game. You may not be getting as many like limited time offer type stuff, um, but most of that stuff is related to Ultimate Team, which I'm not gonna be playing. Um, so if you're wanting to just get access to the game, EA Play plus the Standard Edition. Um, now with the Standard Edition, like I mentioned, you can purchase it. It's $62.99. You're, you're basically making up the $3 difference by getting EA Play. But regardless, the Standard Edition, you don't get to play the game early. But if you have EA Play, you get that 10 hours of gameplay. Now, it looks like with EA Play, you are getting only the 10-hour preview to the game, which doesn't look like there's that same limitation for the Deluxe Edition. So you can kind of get the best of both worlds by getting EA Play. You get a 10% discount, $5.99 a month, a 10% discount on the Deluxe Edition, uh, which uh, turns out to be... I'm trying to see what the actual cost is. So uh, it'd be $89.99 versus $99.99. So you're like saving four bucks, which isn't crazy, but it's better than nothing, right? But it seems like the best way to do this, if you want to get a full three days of gameplay early, is to buy the deluxe edition here, but using EA Play to get the like full trial or at least the discount on this. Um, but yeah, all that being said, I think this is going to be the best way for people to get in, jump in, play the game early. Um, it doesn't look like there's a limitation on the hours you can play for the deluxe edition in regards to early access. This looks like three day early access. 
MVP bundle, you get the early access, but I don't care about Madden. I'm not going to play Madden. I have no desire to play Madden. Um, so what I am most likely going to do is get the Deluxe Edition and purchase it early, get EA Play, and just wait until July. Like, I don't really care about the Ultimate Team stuff that they're going to give, but I do care about playing the game early. Um, all that being said, I appreciate you guys stopping by for the video. Um, I think this is going to be a really good method. I think it's the best method to get uh, early access to the game and get it playing as soon as possible. Thank you so much for stopping by the channel. My name is Alford Avenue. If you enjoyed what you saw, please feel free to leave a like. If you want to see more in the future, more College Football 25 news, more Dynasty uh, gameplay, I'm still doing an Appalachian State Dynasty and NCAA College Football revamp. But yeah, if you want to see more in the future, please subscribe. Thank you all again. See ya!